everybody, it's Chris again, and I am back with a review that I promised you a few weeks back about some Dollar Tree items. If you'd like to see it, keep watching. Hey guys, so I have been down and dirty trying out these Dollar Tree products. I have often wondered about some of them. I don't know, you know, I, I just didn't know how they'd all work out. And so I picked all of these things up. Let me stress that I don't have any children at home, little children, and but I do have my grandkids here very often. So my house isn't extremely dirty to begin with, but I can assure you that these products on my furnishings, on my floors, in my bathroom work fabulous. I have a strange kind of, it's not strange, but it's some weird kind of bathtub kind of finish. It's not... It's not a finish, it's just a uh, kind of bathtub, it's, it's not porcelain. Let's just put that, it's not porcelain. So, it doesn't get extremely dirty and like my husband works in an office, it's, it's not like, you know, he's working with cars and, and everything gets extremely dirty. So let's just start with this. First off, I can tell you I love all these products and I'll explain why. Let's start with my favorite. This is the Brillo brand basics and they are wet sweeper cloth refills. I'm going to try to, to do this part of the review and another part of the review without using the nasty M word that like everybody in the world hates. You know the one I'm talking about. These Brillo Basics Wet Sweeper Cloth Refills, absolutely, positively not one ounce better than these. You get eight in here for one dollar, and I like to keep these, like I like to keep one in both bathrooms and one in the kitchen, so that's what I have, and I have a full box of the brand name to work through as well, but these will be my go-tos, like, every single time. And I scrub my floor on my hands and knees um, like once a month or so. So it's not like I have major cleaning to do with these either, but I have no doubt that they would hold up for you perfectly with any, any messy floor situation. So those, yay! My grandson is into this thumbs up thing, so I'm like, all the time. Me and my husband are always like, Anyway, we're out to be the coolest known and pop up on the earth. We're striving for that. Next is the furniture wipes. Nice lemon scent. They're not like, oh, end dust. I swear, I swear I hate end dust. And I think it just attracts more stuff. And dog hair. Definitely dog hair. These were perfect. I, I like ease. I, I, don't get me wrong. I actually love to clean. I'm one of those people who literally loves to clean and you have the nice smell. I found these in no way, shape, or form attracted more dust, more of your dog hair, Sophia. You need to keep your hair on, girl. And I love them. And there are, see, there's the word. See it? It's the word I'm going to try not to say. Uh-huh, you see it, don't you? Pre, I'll say it, pre-moistened. <laughs> Actually, the word doesn't really bother me, so what is... It's cracking me up, because I know some of you are like, oh dear, oh dear, she's going to say it, she's going to say it, she said it. Moist, 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 moist! Anyway. And last but not least are the Brillo Basics Heavy Duty Scour Pads. Now, I did say I loved all of this stuff. And I do, that's true. There were two in here. I love these. And while I will probably continue to repurchase these, they can never See, only a clean freak or somebody who, 
I feel like not everybody has specific products they can't live without. Some women are like, oh, I can't live without my, you know, blank, blank, blank lippy. And some guys are like, I can't live without my, you know, whatever club at the golf course. I'm like, I can't live without my Scotch Bright heavy duty scouring pads. I'm a loser. I know it. Because really, like a real one would be like, oh, I gotta have this nail polish, or I can't live without my cafe latte mocha iced over frappuccino with whipped cream and skinny latte. And I'm over here like, give me Scotch Bright scour pads, give me Scotch Bright scour pads. Anyway, so. I love these and while, like I said, keep it, I use these in my bathtub and my shower. Keep in mind that, like I said, it's not like we're, you know, grease monkeys or we're working dirt or, you know, a farmer or a factory worker or somebody who gets dirty in their work, um, construction, anything like that. So our bathtub and shower are never really filthy. But these work great on what I have. What I had before we moved, I'm not sure this would have worked great. You get two of these for a buck, and ever since, when did I make that video? Well, I'm still using the same one. So, and I scrub my bathtub mm, at least once a week, sometimes two times a week. I hope this helps because I know there's been times when I've wondered how products worked. And even though they're a dollar, you're like, but still, if they completely suck, why, you know, why spend the dollar? Okay, that sounded really cheap. Why spend the dollar? Because you could use it on something. Anyway, thanks for joining me. I hope that this was helpful and informative. And I hope you hit the subscribe button and then ringy ding my bell so that you will get ring my bell, ring my bell, ring a ring, ring a ring a ring. I used to teach my students to sing that song, just that part. Anyway, ring the bell or click the little bell so that you'll get notifications of when I make videos. I hope that you will come back and never miss the hits and sometimes misses of my kitchen and my life.